I'm at the Catalan Art Museum and I'm looking onto this huge painting by Georgie, Geordie Bass, painted in 1937 in Barcelona and it depicts the terrible events in Badajoz on the 14th of August 1936 when General Yangwe, Franco's rebel, one of Franco's rebel generals, entered the town of Badajoz in Extremadura. First hundreds were murdered quite simply on the streets, men, women and children, and then the rest, the majority, thousands, were herded into the bull ring and massacred, and between 2,000 and 4,000 people, men, women and children, were murdered. And as we can see here, we've got this mass of humans desperately trying to resist the bullets, um, men, women and children. There's a, um, this, this man here, you can clearly identify him ideologically. Um, others, many are wearing blue overalls, which is a, a, a working class symbol. And on the other side, we've got the executioners and their, and their spectators, their supporters. There's the, the legionnaires who are doing the killing and there's a priest there, there's a carlist, there's a wealthy lady, uh, different sectors of Francoist society enjoying the entertainment and looking slightly bored. And it's also, I think, worth saying that both bull rings and other sports centres were used frequently during the Spanish Civil War for mass murder by the rebel side, by Franco's side, and they, op they, are, they offered they offer a perfect opportunity for an enclosed space to commit murder, used in other situations we can think of, for example, in 1973 by Pinochet in the National Stadium in Chile. And of course I think also there's this thing we should say that bulls did represent um, a, a symbol of class because to, ha to have a bull, to be able to raise a fighting bull you need an awful lot of land, you need to push peasants off the estates, and because of that, the bullfighting itself became very much hated on many on the Republican side, not all, but many, and also because of the, of the, of the violence and cruelty that it represented.